I'm Al St. Lawrence, Sheriff of Chatham County. If you are here to visit an inmate, we welcome you to the Chatham County Jail. You need to know that inmate visitation is a privilege, not a right. We encourage you to visit, but we must insist on some basic rules. Could you give me a 21 or a 25, please? If you are in the lobby of our detention center, you are within the guard line of the facility. No weapons are permitted. Visitors may take wallets and car keys into the visitation room. You cannot have purses, chewing gum, smoking material, cell phones, satchels, or diaper bags. Smoking, eating, and drinking are not permitted. You may use the lockers in the lobby to store personal items at your own risk. If you need a wheelchair, the jail will provide one for you. If there are small children, you may also have one baby bottle, one diaper, and one blanket. The lobby deputy may approve additional items on a case-by-case -case basis. Yes, ma'am, can I have? All visitors will have to surrender a government-issued photo ID to the lobby deputy. Please remember to retrieve your ID when you leave. Your visit will take place in a visitation room. The inmate will appear on the other side of the plexiglass. You will speak and listen through a speaker or handset. An inmate is allowed a maximum of two visitors at a time. Children under 16 must be accompanied by an adult. Underage visitors must be closely supervised by a parent or guardian. Everything will work out. Don't assume that your visit is private. A deputy can see and hear both parties in all visits. Under our rules, a visitor may not be under the influence of drugs or alcohol. And a visitor cannot wear improper attire. You must wear shoes and a shirt. You must wear appropriate underclothing. You cannot wear any suggestive clothing. No see-through fabrics, no halter or tube tops, no mini skirts, no short shorts. Yeah, I agree. During the visit, there cannot be loud talking, excessive emotionalism, or disruptive behavior. The visit will last no longer than 20 minutes. Once you leave, that will end your visit. At any time before or after your visit, you may make deposits into an inmate's commissary account. The inmate can use those funds to buy snacks, drinks, toiletries, magazines, underwear, and other supplies. I want to put some money on the books for Melvin Kent. Visitors may leave funds for inmates with the staff at the cashier window in the lobby. Five dollars. Staff will only accept cash, money orders, or cashier's checks. You will get a receipt. Failure to abide by these rules may end your visit and result in the termination of future visitation privileges. Again, welcome to the Chatham County Detention Center.